नेक्स्ट ऑप्शन इज माइनस सी अ कंटिन्यूस पिंग सो इफ वी सेंड माइनस सी पिंग विथ माइनस सी ऑप्शन ping will keep on pinging the host or ping will keep on sending icmp ping request continuously to that host by default ping sends only four packets with no any extra command line option but if if we preceded or if we add a minus c option to the ping it will do a continuous ping to stop this i have to press control c now if we want to change the time delay between two ping packets now this is very handy tool for many network programmers and for many product verification guys they want to see the throughput of the system and for checking the throughput how much packets a system can handle how much packets the switch can handle for this you want to simulate large number of packets and to simulate large number of packets in very small amount of time a ping will be a handy tool you can generate two ping packets with delay of 1 millisecond only so okay so if i ask f ping to send packets with minus t option and say 10 f ping will go ahead and it will send packets with 10 millisecond as a delay so if i do it continuously f ping will go ahead and it will keep on sending the packets with 10 millisecond as the ping delay okay i have to press control c to stop next option is minus w minus w is very important option again you want to set a value for which ping should wait for the reply so if i want ping to wait only for 10 milliseconds or if i want ping to wait only for 100 millisecond for the reply i can program it by default a ping will wait for 5 seconds to get the reply from the host but i can change that value i can tweak that value as i wish so in the above example if i do minus w and say 30 then ping will keep on waiting for 30 millisecond to get a reply and interestingly in this trace there are some request timeouts because i am pinging www.google.com which is not very near to me there are at least 7 8 hops between my machine and the google.com machine there are some 7 8 routers servers what not i don't know so there is going to be some finite amount of delay for ping and i have asked ping only to wait for 30 milliseconds so every packet which comes after 30 millisecond will not be taken into consideration or ping will not at least wait for more than 30 millisecond if some packet just comes after 30 millisecond it will be received by the uh, nick but ping will not wait for more than 30 milliseconds okay that's why you are seeing these request timeouts in between let's go ahead let's proceed next option is minus n option so how many number of packets you want to send so of course minus n option will not work with minus c option minus c option is a continuous option which will always override so if i give minus n 10 so now only 10 ping packets will be generated send packets are 10 received are 10 okay so with minus n option you can restrict number of packets or you can ask ping to send only those many number of packets next option is minus h hops if i only want to go 10 hops from here for pinging any particular host machine i can specify that with minus h option so if i do fping.exe www.google.com and minus h say 10 it will go 10 hops to reach www.google.com and yes it is a success now if i do minus h 8 still it is a success so google is somewhere between 1 to 8 1 to 8 hops if i do minus 7 it is not a success which clearly means for me to reach google i have to use ttl value at least 8 or google is 8 hops away from me okay these simple things can be easily figured out with this fping utility okay next option is minus v type of service type of service 
now in ip header there is a separate header which specifies which specifies which service the packet is intended for i can change that type of service from 0 to 255 with minus v option okay now next option is minus r option record route you can record the route with minus r option so that which route take what amount of time how much time packet was pending in that route all this information can be seen with minus r option next option is minus capital r that is random length between minimum and maximum length if you want to if you want fping to choose the length of the data embedded between some upper and lower limits you can specify that with minus r option so if i say minus r 100 slash 200 minus n 10 so i want to send 10 packets which are in between 100 and 200 of the ping size now ping is sending 10 packets which are between 100 and 200 see 174 164 145 110 and like this it has picked some 10 random values for generating the data 